Hello there, gamers, minecrafters, explorers, and adventurers. I am the Killer Gamer, and look at this. It is all the mods 10. This has just been recently released as of the recording of this video, which was June 26th, I believe uh, just a couple days ago, either yesterday or the day before that it was released. And for the first time on this channel, we are getting to the very beginning of a mod pack that's been released all the other ones that we've been working on have already been out this one we're, we're right there at the beginning and this has only got 124 mods so far so it's got a long ways to go before it gets anywhere near to where the other packs are at but this is for uh the latest minecraft 1.21 and this uses Neoforge, not Forge, but the uh, the branch off of that, uh, Neoforge. There's a lot of drama behind the scenes as to why there's a Forge and a Neoforge. And I think Forge is pretty much done from what I've been gathering. And it's just going to be Neoforge uh, from here out, along with Fabric and Quilt. I don't know what's going on with that. But um, we'll have to see because I, I've always felt that Forge was the main mod loader. That's where all the good stuff was at. Uh, but Fabric was a better performer. And they had some good mods too. So we'll have to see if Neo Forge uh, kind of takes the reins or if maybe everything goes to Fabric now. We'll have to see. But yeah, let's go ahead and create a new world here this has got all that new what is this trials and tribulations up update i forget <laughs> trials and trails or i don't know i don't i forget what this is all right we're gonna do hardcore because you know of course how about we call this trials <laughs> of the killer gamer it's gonna be the name of this and that is also going to be the name of the seed. Yeah, I don't think we have really much uh, to, to go here. Hey, how about if I go ahead and pull up the list of mods that are in this pack here. Just so you can get an idea how many there is i'll just pull it up here from uh curse forge which i highly recommend that you get it really makes things easier even if you want to create your own mod pack curse forge is awesome uh, maybe i'll do a tutorial about it okay so here we go we got 116 mods we got accelerated decay adorned which is part of the curios Applied uh, inner energetics. That's not it. Engineering. Applied engineering. <laughs> AI improvements, tweaks. The you got some like uh, core files that's needed for some aquaculture. All the ores. Bad packets. Okay, better F3. That's a good one. That makes the F3. You know all the stats and kind of color codes them and stuff. It's kind of nice. Uh, CC, that is what? Computer craft, right? Charging gadgets, chisel, reborn, clean swing through grass. That's a nice one to have. Cl 
clumps. Uh, that takes care of all the experience orbs. Makes it so that way it's not making your uh, game lag. Connect the textures, controlling, cooking for blockheads. Okay, that's been around for a while. Crafting on a stick. Creeper overhaul gives you different, different types of creepers. That's been around for a while, too. Embedium. I'm actually surprised. Some of the stuff from, uh, from fabric seems to be over here, too. EMI, Entity Culling, Explorer's Compass, that one's been around for a while. Explorify Dungeons and Structures, that's a new one that I've been noticing. I think that one might... Wasn't this on Fabric? Extreme Sound Muffler, Factory Blocks, Fancy Menu, been around. Farming for Blockheads, been around. Uh, you got Feed the Beast stuff right here. That's used a lot. Fuel goes here. Now, this is an interesting. I haven't seen this one before. Generator galore. Get it together. Drops. Global packs. Gravestone mod. We've had several different types of those. Handcrafted hardened armadillos. I think that might... That's that's a new mod. Specific to 1.21 because they added the armadillos. Iron furnaces. Jam lib. Journey map. That one's been around for a while. I like journey map. I prefer that one compared to zero maps. Do you guys want to see a, a series where I do a, re a review of mods? Not mod packs, because <laughs> I'd have to be able to play through the whole thing to be able to do a, a fair review. But mods, on the other hand, is another thing. There's already other channels out there doing it. But, I don't know, maybe you'd like to see my take on it. I don't know. Jumpy Boats, Just Dire Things, Laser I.O. Okay, McCall's. Uh, his bridges, doors, fences, walls, lights, lamps, paths, pavings, trap doors. He, those have been around for a while. We don't have biomes of plenty, though. That's disappointing. Measurements, mechanism. So we're going to have mechanized stuff in this. I think these have been around for a bit. Melody, mining gadgets, most structures. Modern dynamics, modern industrialization. So yeah, we're going to have some tech mods in this one. Uh, modular routers, mouse tweaks. That's been a while around for a bit. Nature's compass, same thing. Nether portal fix. No chat reports. Occultism. Open blocks elevator. Power. Been around a bit. Pylons, repurposed structures. Resource lib, right click harvest, searchable, security craft, showcase item, simple backups, smart brain, spark, structurary, structurary towers. I've recently seen these two. Tool belt, trash lot. I like trash lot, that's nice to have. Instead of how you know, you don't want something, you can at least trash it in your inventory. You don't have to like toss it, like throw it. <laughs> Utilitarian, Waystones, that, that one's been around for a while. Uh, what the hell, It Forge Edition? I have no idea. Uh, XY Craft, apparently from what I've read, that this has recently come back. Uh, what was it? They were... One of their old ones was like, what, 1.7 for Minecraft? It was way back then. So yeah, XY Craft um, is in here. X... Oh, that's right. X. Is it Z? YZ craft. There's, a, there's another one, but I don't think it's for 1.21. And uh, Yeetus Experimentus. That's it. So that's all we've got there. This, uh, this list is going to grow. So we'll be able to grow with it on this series. So it should be pretty good. All right. Here we are. Look at this. You know, some of the journey maps will show you where stuff is at, and then other ones don't. So it's kind of annoying. What the heck is this? Oh, we got chickens and pigs. Any sheep? That doesn't look like it. Okay, well, let's make our way down here.
do a usually usual spiel here. Gotta get some oak logs. Oh, you know what? It's got just enough items, and I didn't even notice that. Okay, we need just some more. All right, we're going to There's stone right over here. get let's get busy let's get what we need we might even make this our starter home here Kinda like that idea. Cause look, we, we're right here next to a river. We can we can have a little farm. We can put one across here. We can put a little bridge. I kind of like that idea. So this is why I have another series called. Um, whoops, that's not what I want to do. Called uh, corner to corner. Because it's an exploration uh, series. Because <laughs> when I tend to play, it's like, oh, this looks like a good place. Or I'll go a little bit further and I'm like, yeah, I think this will do. And, uh, you know, I don't really go out and explore very much. So that's why I have that one. You know, and we may still, you know, explore. I'm pretty sure we will. I don't think we have a uh, leaf decay mod. No, we do not. Yes, we do. <laughs> it disappeared quickly. How, how am I not seeing this stuff? I, like, I didn't see it in the list. Myself a variety of different wood. I had debated on waiting uh, to do to do any videos on this, but I just thought, you know what? This is an opportunity to actually get in at the very beginning of a mod pack coming out, because you know this is going to be a big mod pack. You know, this is going to be uh, another mo uh, popular mod pack from them. So. And I just think it might be interesting to see how it develops over time, too. Let's take care of these trees here. Because they're kind of in the way of what I want to do here. Now, it may not take too long for Biomes of Plenty to get uh, converted. Ooh, look at the map there. There's, there's like creepers. Why are they red? Oh, I bet that's that one mod pack. Makes them red. What's this? Oh, this is... Oh, that's part of Zycraft world. 
But this dripstone block, there's a there's a cave underneath there, isn't there? Ooh, okay. I'm gonna keep that in mind. Ooh, got an apple. Okay, and we got some sand here. That means we can make some glass. Well, let's see. What am I going to do here? Um, put that there. That's not what I wanted to do. <laughs> I'm just taking a dip, you know. I'm just taking a swim. That's it. Okay. Let me just go ahead and make some glass right there. We have enough for a furnace. Go ahead and put that in the wall right here. Oh, yeah. Um, we can't put shaders in yet. We don't have uh, anything for the mod pack to put shaders in just yet. So that'll come in a little bit, uh, a little later. And I'm sure the Distant Horizons mod, mod would uh, come in here too. fire there. There we go. Let that go. And let's go ahead and make our door. some glass here and then burn some more oak logs. Okay. Let's 
getting to be nighttime. put something different up here for the ceiling. We'll have to see. Okay, we seem to be in a good spot here, so let's take a look at the good old quest book here. All the Mods 10 is now in open beta. Oh, okay, so this is beta. This is not a, an actual release. Welcome to All the Mods 10 on 1.21, now on NeoForge. The version of Minecraft is very new and will take some time to grow. With each update, you will notice more and more mods being added, and then eventually quests will start coming out. Oh, so the quests are not out yet. <laughs> With each update, you will notice more and more... Okay, we just said that. This pack is for those of us that love to test new things and want to see how the pack grows over time. If you want a more, ex more complete experience, you want to play all the mods 9 for now, which we have been doing on the channel. That get some cookies and stuff. Yeah, so we don't have any quests. No quests. That is that's all. That's all folks. You know, I figured I'd have a front room here and, you know, maybe we'll uh, make a bedroom or something here. is down there they're they're like lights or something
That's the wrong one. <laughs> See, this will be the bedroom, and I've got a corner view, so we need to do some more glass here. We'll just do that. Go. Look at that. Got a nice uh, window view here, I think. I am going to need some more birchwood, though. See, I can even set this up and put my um, enchanting room off to the side. Um, yeah, there's quite a bit I can do here. I like this. All right. Those creepers are red. Do you see that? Look at these. Okay, we got fish, minnows. Creeper, Minecraft creeper, that's that one mod. Skeletons, there's our chickens. Got a zombie right there. There's something over here. Looks like there's a... Well, maybe we'll go exploring over here. <laughs> Phone says toll-free call. <laughs> yeah! How about we don't answer that? turn this into like a little dock area. Uh-huh. I need a shovel. Let's go make a shovel. We got to open this up right here.
we got some puppies over here. some pretty colors of dogs over here. Man, I wish I had some bones. We need some pork. Here we go. What do we got here? Candles? Something else? <laughs> How about we not fight anything until I actually get some armor? You know, that might be a good thing. Wait, you stop moving around. <laughs> Cows. And I think I see sheep. No, they're not sheep. They're underground, whatever they are. Darn. There is something coming my way. Over here. Oh, bees. Okay. Got a little birch forest going on here.
this is an interesting underground little thing there. I've misplaced my boat. <laughs> Might be over here somewhere. There it is. It's getting to be night time. Back to our place. Say we explored a little bit. Get over to our dark, dark, the dock. All right. Ah, ouch. I want to set some torches out here. Wood, I'm not sure. We got ourselves some spruce saplings. So we'll be able to make our own little controlled forest over there. Or tree farm. Demon's dream seeds. Plant to grow demon's dream fruit. Interesting. This may allow you to see beyond the veil. It may also cause general... Okay, well, that's going to be interesting, whatever that is. <laughs> Alright, we got some eggs. We'll make a chicken farm. I'm going to do that inside because of the dogs out there. They tend to make their way through fences. I've noticed. At least they do on bedrock. I don't need the sand. We can put the sand right in here. Let's go ahead and cook some raw pork chops. Kind of a small little bedroom, isn't it? Doesn't need to be any bigger, though. That's the thing. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. The 
this is going to be the enchanting room. You know, so actually there's going to be a lot that we can, that we'll be able to do in this. I can get my base fully established uh, before we even start getting the quests and stuff. So it's actually going to be kind of nice. Right there is where the enchanting table is going to go. right here is going to have books so we need to go one more I didn't have to do that go we still got to do stuff with that but all right so we got our bedroom and the enchanting room which is bigger than the bedroom <laughs> now I'm gonna go ahead and make a little chicken chicken coop we'll put that back here somewhere something like that right there okay that thought that might work nope oh here we go there we go see and eventually I can replace this with glowstone right
I might go ahead and put some windows in here. I'm going to put a door right here. Oh, whoa, did I use all my torches? I guess so. Huh. I didn't think I did that. there for a moment. Got ourselves some cooked pork chop. Got some gravel. Got ten over here. Good 
Damn, we got a bonus. I ain't gonna worry about that. I could actually make a whole indoor farm over here. Not a bad idea, considering we're on hardcore. See, coming this way looks like, you know, you're going outside, but you're not, actually. All right. Okay, how far does this go? I think we found the end, finally. Not that end. <laughs> going here. And then we'll fill this whole area. Not this. I'm going to put a fence right here. But we'll fill this whole area up with dirt. And I was thinking about maybe making a porch. There's plenty of dirt that we can get. It's not a biggie. See, if I make a porch over here, then I can bring some animals and bring them back here and I can offload them in here. Well, we're going to have a lot of tin. <laughs>
getting a variety of ore now. Yeah, I guess we're doing a little bit of mining, aren't we? I think we finally So we know all this is going to be dirt. We need that storage drawers available. Whoops. Did I not? Okay, I do have the rest of the glass. do have the Ultimine ability. That's good. There we go. So all this is going to be filled in with dirt right here.
And I want to put the forge somewhere else so this is a front room. Right now this is kind of temporary. I guess maybe I could put the forge. I don't know. Maybe we'll build another room. But where are we going to put it though? That's the thing. Can't put it that way. I guess we could make a room this direction, right? Could have a storage room and a forge or something. I thought I had one more door. We'll use this. No, because then it looks like it's a main door. I don't like that. <laughs> I don't know where we're going to use those. Use it somewhere. We need to do something here. Okay. Looks good. Good. I hear a kitty do. Oh, okay. Scratching. Scratching where they should be scratching. Okay. Yeah, this is looking good, I think. So this can be the forge area. And a little storage area as well. Wouldn't it be cool if we step down here? And then I kind of like that idea. So let's do a step down. We'll use a stone stair here. We can put a stone thing right there. And then that way I can put a storage uh, chest here, here, and here. Now I'm doing this because I only want to use one charcoal. I want to try to make the use of what I have while I have it. Eventually I, I think I might make 
two more forges here. Now, we're going to fill this, all this up with forges because uh, could be useful. All right, one, one, two, three. Chess. I thought I thought we might get different color chess, but apparently not. open. We're going to have to do that. Getting organized. Let's put all the ores in this one. And we'll put, yeah, I'm gonna put cobblestone up there, stone down here. And up there will be wood stuff. Let's keep that wood. Oops. Plenty of dirt. Thank you. 
take a swim here. <laughs> wow, we got some lava, like, <laughs> right next door. I thought I heard it. That was close. this, I just not realized this, can make a garden right here. just realized that if I open this up I can make this all watch watch what I'm going to do here <laughs> See? Because I don't have a bucket yet, but I can have the start of my little gardening thing. I thought I had another shovel. Apparently not. Yeah, I know there is copper there. I ain't worried about it. our better F3. We are on day now. I'm not sure. This is like all over the place, so I don't know what day it is. Current time, 1858. There's 70 monsters out there. Holy crap. Where are they all coming from? I was going to try to get us to day five, but I don't know where day... F I don't know where the days are at. Oh, well. What was I doing? Uh, I don't remember. It's getting dark again.
Well, okay. I think um, I think this is actually a good place to stop for right now. Um, it doesn't have to be five days. Um, we can actually take our time a little bit on this one since it's going to take time for them to, to get this updated with mods. So I don't see a rush. But thank you for joining me. And I hope you'll stick with me on this series so that way we can see how it develops together. And this could turn out to be a really good series because I'm starting right from, you know, right from the get go and, you know, building up uh, what I can, you know, until we can start working on quests when they get those out and whatever, uh, whatever, you know, mod your quest that they can do so you know we can do a lot of regular minecraft stuff and just get prepared i think that's kind of cool all right well thanks for watching we'll see you next time be sure to watch the other minecraft videos that i've got see you next time have a killer awesome day